Hello all, welcome to Learning Slate. Today, I'm going to tell a story which creates awareness about sensitive and important life issues. Bullying. Bullying at school is one of the widely spread issues faced by children the world over. In this one, the story tries to address the issue of bullying. Through this story, we gently try to bring awareness about what is bullying, what kind of behavior amounts to bullying, and the possible ways to handle it. Shall we start the story then? Bullying Sam tried to hide under a table after walking into the cafeteria. His eyes were moving all over the cafeteria. He was trying to hide from someone. Sam felt a hand on his shoulder. It was Ron, his senior. Ron had seen him. Sam, are you looking for me? Ron said. Sam's shoulder drooped. Ron grabbed Sam's lunchbox and ate his lunch. All Sam could do was watch. Ron did this every day. Sam had been going home hungry every day. He felt confused. The teacher always said it was good to share, but Ron ate all his lunch without asking. This was not sharing. Next day, Sam's friend Ben saw what Ron did. Ben said, Sam, why do you let Ron bully you? Sam asked, Bully? Ben explained, If he is caring and forcing you, it is bullying. You should tell your mom about it. Sam thought about it. He was so confused. Should he tell the teacher about it? What could he tell mom? What if Ron found out he had said something? Sam was a little scared of Ron. Sam thought and thought on the way. His stomach hurt. He was so hungry. He felt miserable. At home, mom said, Hey Sam, how was your day, honey? Sam said, It was okay, I guess. I'm really hungry, mom. For the last few days, mom had been seeing Sam return home really hungry. She gave Sam a plate of mashed potatoes. He quickly ate all and asked for more. Honey, did you not eat your lunch? asked mom. Sam hesitated. He then told her about what Ron had been doing. Mom said gently, Honey, what Ron is doing is wrong. Ron is bullying you. I am so happy that you told me. Mom hugged Sam. I will talk to your teacher about it. Is that okay? She added. Sam said, I don't want the teacher to know Mom. Mom said, Okay, how about this? Tomorrow, I'll give you two lunch boxes. Give one to Ron and you can eat the other one. You can be so nice to Ron that he can't be mean to you. She smiled. Everything will be alright, I promise. The next day, Sam was not hiding. He and Ben went to Ron and gave the lunch box mom had packed for Ron. Ron was surprised. When Ron asked what Sam had in his lunchbox, he showed to Ron that both the lunchboxes had same food. Ben and Sam turned and left to eat their lunch. Sam felt good and brave. He was not as scared anymore. To be extra careful, Mom had informed Sam and Ron's teacher about what was going on. They had decided to wait and watch what Sam's kind gesture of getting an extra lunch for Ron to do. For the next whole week, Sam gave the extra lunch box to Ron. Every day, Mom asked Sam about Ron and told Sam how brave and wonderful he was. After a week, Ron felt ashamed. He stopped taking the lunch from Sam. The teacher had a long talk with Ron about his behavior. Ron understood that what he did was wrong. Ron had not realized that his behavior had been hurting Sam. By being brave and kind, Sam had stood up to his bully. Hope you like this story.
you all enjoyed the story please follow my channel to listen to the other stories in the series they are good touch bad touch insult making choices prejudice respecting others teasing violence see you soon bye bye